Hello everybody, how is everyone doing? My name is Crit Hammer, and sorry if this video comes out a little late in regards to the update. I had recently just gotten into Pokemon Go, and on a Pokemon expedition that I took three days ago, I had recently gotten trapped in the void that separates our dimension from the next. But luckily I came back relatively unharmed, I even got myself a shiny Charizard. Um, but anyways, let's hop right into the video. I love whenever game developers and game teams and indie devs or whatever take critique and complaints from their game community. I love it because that means that's an actual game team that cares about what their players have to say and think about the game that they have made. And whenever they base the gameplay and the game mechanics around what the majority of them are saying, that's really good because, like I said, that is a game team that actually cares about the enjoyment of the people that play it. But whenever we're referring to something as large as two of the main classes and two of the different types of gameplay mechanics like we are with the heavy versus pyro meet your match update we are dealing with too much power and that's that's not what valve should have done both heavy and pyro deserve a rework they both they both do because it's been long overdue for heavy to actually be fun again and it's been long overdue for pyro to get the fucking rebounds they deserve and as much as I hate to say this, it seems like the Heavy, Team Heavy, is going to lose this. And if they do, and they get the rework, and it makes it even less fun to play... I mean, if Valve reworks Heavy and makes him actually fun to play, like, he, like they add a different mechanic, or they they, re, they rework his damage and his health, maybe, maybe, maybe they make him do a bit more damage with the cost of not being so tanky or whatever, that'd be nice. If they make Heavy more fun to play and actually have a reason to play him, that'd be nice. But having a class that is as broken and as nerfed as the Heavy in a game where there's only nine classes to play and like so many types of game, so many types of gameplay and game style, is not how you want to go about this thing. They both deserve a rework. And moving on to the Pyro. Pyro's been long overdue for a fucking rework. He's fucking broken. And sure, you can say that, oh, you can easily deal with Pyros. I mean, you, you can outsmart them. Most of the time, they're only 12 years old. Well, here's the deal. Yes, you can. With every class in TF2, you can think of some kind of, some kind of mandated strategy and some kind of really, like, really clever, like some, some general patent in North Africa during World War II kind of shit. You can think of that. But at the time that that pyro turns around to you and he starts barreling on his W key and slams on his left mouse button, your strategy's done. It doesn't matter how much you planned on using the map to your advantage or you wanted to bait your teammate or you wanted to go in with overpowering numbers and you wanted to shock and all. It doesn't matter. Because at that point, your strategy's done. Because at the time that his bugged unrigged particles coll collide with your body, your health is gone. You are fucking ashes, my boy. At that point, there's not even a point in trying to enjoy the game. You can't fight a pyro like that. And sure, I'm gonna get people saying, like, oh, if you if you catch him out, or if you, if you get him by surprise, or if they don't have a lot of health, and blah, blah, blah. No, that, that's not how that works. Because... These kinds of pyro mains and extreme quotations are fucking brain dead. They're not gonna realize like, oh, I'm outnumbered or I'm out strategized or I'm at health. I'm just gonna run at people, and nine times out of ten, you'll you'll get killed because of it. The pyro will kill you. Doesn't matter how fucking bad their strategy was, at a core mechanic, at a arsenal mechanic, the pyro is fucking broken. It's just not fun to play against, and he deserves a rework because of it. And I'm not saying to, like, remove Pyro anything, or to, like, really nerf Pyro, or to tell Valve that you're gonna fucking cut Gabe's beard off if you don't, but something needs to be done about Pyros, because I don't want another 10 years from now, and that the Valve community, and the TF2 community, and TF2 from a whole has gone into the shitter and de-evolved so much that every single casual, competitive, and community server is just literally 24 or 12 pyros just fucking running at each other. 
because at this point, if nothing is done, that is literally how it's going to be because that is all you need to do to secure kills and play pyro and have fun and quotations. It's to ream bolded, underlined quotations around fun. So, thank you so much. If you like this, leave a like, favorite, subscribe, tell me your opinion. I would like to know. And hopefully, something will be done about this. Maybe Valve will actually fucking listen to their community for once and they'll actually make heavy fun. So bye.